fish out there. Looks like a 400 pound hammerhead. Look at me, it's right coming up on the top. Look at this. Come in for the boat. Oh, damn it, that's 500 pound fish. Look at the size of that. And we caught it on a rental boat. Man, what a fish. What a shark. Hi, I'm Graham Pullen, and welcome to another edition of Totally Awesome Fishing. Yes, the vintage series, where you get to see me looking a lot younger than I am at the moment. Now then, this one that you're going to look at is the Florida Keys. Now, all my family fish, so when we go on a fishing holiday to the Florida Keys, sooner or later you're going to get a day off. You're with the family, bucket and spade, beach, go and do sea world, all those sort of things. Wrong. In the Pullen family, do you know what we do on the day off? We go fishing. Okay, this time I went in a rental boat, just a self-drive boat, but boy, was it a day with a difference. Just check out what we call fishing on our own three miles out in the Atlantic Ocean. Brought the wife and kids out. This one's Charlotte. Hello. Charlotte is the champion pinfish catcher, aren't you, Charlie? Yeah. And what else have you caught? Have you caught much, much in the way of big fish? No, only a few little ones. Oh, only a few small ones, have you? Oh, I thought you caught some nurse sharks last year, but not to worry. Uh, this is Mike. Hello. Mike is the champion mangoes. Snapper. Snapper. Catcher. Catcher. Yeah, and he's also having to catch pinfish. This is the crew. Uh, Hilary, not sure which way the video appears, as you can see working really hard she is actually here. But what I wanted to show you before we start fishing is, if you go in the trading post and you ask for, down here, a small sandwich, this is what you get. This is a ham sandwich for my son Michael. That is hardly a sandwich, is it? That is three quarters of a dead pig between two pieces of bread. There must be a hundred slices in there, and the only way you can eat these as most men would agree, as if you wash it down with one of these. So that's the only way to eat these sandwiches. Anyway, we're going to go fishing. We've got a load of pinfish in the in the live well at the back there, and we've got Captain John Watts, who's down in the back there. He's fishing away with the last uh, few days of his party. I think he's taking them back to the airport. And we're in a channel on um, Twin Key Bank which I've not fished before, so basically we'll see if we catch something. If we don't, we're going to catch something tomorrow. Around the can, I've got the family with me. Got four rods down for about half an hour. And we've got a really, really huge shark hooked up here. I'm not sure what it is, it's massive. We've got the remora around the side of the boat, still trying to eat the rubby bag. It's got no shoulder harness. This is an immense fish. I might have to pass the rod off and get the anchor up. We've got the anchor rope and we've got the can over there. You've got to be careful of. I can't tell you how big it looks. First time we saw it on the surface, it looked 10 feet long. We've got it on 50. I think I'm going to have to start the engine and pull the anchor rope. There's the fish down there, it's coming. I hope we don't go around the anchor. Do you see him down there? Michael, we'll be careful. Michael, be careful. Trying to get the anchor rope up now. Wife's well, got the anchor up. Get it right in the boat, Hillary. He's got okay, we've got a chance. I'm gonna shut the video down, I'm gonna have to put gloves on. You've only got the can. Switch it off, mate. Got him on? Yep. Is he on wreck? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. There's a fish out there, looks like a 400 pound hammerhead. Look. Right on the surface. Big fish. I think it's a really huge hammerhead. Dad, you're on camera. Yeah, it's on. Oh, yeah, man, I've got it. It's on, it's on! Got a hammerhead here. I'm just about shocked because I've got no harness. I reckon it's somewhere between four and five hundred pounds. And I've got no gloves. Here he is, right coming up on the top. Look at this. Coming for the boat. God oh, damn it, that's 500 pound fish. Woo! That's just 500 pound hammerhead. 
Look at the size of that. And we caught it on a rental boat. That is a cool fish. Now, the trouble is, I've got no gloves. I'm not sure what to do with it now. Or what it's going to do with me. More to the point. Where's that rope, mate? Hold on, I'll do it. just daddy that boat. There? Yes. Here. There's a fish out there. We've had the leader once. He's too big, we've had to let him go. So we technically caught the fish. Anything we get from here on is a bonus. I'm going to try and plane him in so you can see him on the screen. He's got a huge belly on him. Half the length of the skiff. He's, 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 we reckon he's at least 500 pounds. Here we come. Here we go. Even a bit further. Man, what a fish! Oh my god! That is a big fat camera head. They don't get much bigger than that. And I've got it. I had it, sorry. I can't do anything with it because it's just in. I've left my glove. Yeah. I can't film it. Give Mike the camera. I'll just film that. He gets a video first. Careful. You want to let him go if you can? You want to let him go? That's what you want to do? Yomio. Yomio came over from another boat. We couldn't manage him on our own. He's a really big hammerhead. It's got to go four, five hundred pounds. We can't even lift him out of the water. He's immense. Huge stomach. Big, big shark. Big shark. They give you an idea of him there. Hey. That's a big hammerhead. Yeah. Heavy. Heavy. Let him down a little. That's your rope, the one up front. That's eight feet. Keep this there. Eight feet. He's about nine feet. About well, nine feet. That's eight feet. That's nine feet. Yeah. Nine feet. That's brilliant. It's a nine foot hammerhead. Nine foot hammerhead. Jeez. Look at that. Try to get the camera. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, the camera. I, I bend it. I bend it <laughs> back, but it was completely open. Brilliant. Well, that was about as big a fish as I've ever caught in a small rental boat like this. And I did say earlier on it was half the size of the boat, nine foot, and we're in an 18 foot Boston Whaler self drive boat. So I figure, although we dropped the rods and reels down and baits and stuff, for another one. We've let those other people take that fishing and say want to eat it. Uh, it's too big for us to cut. We'd never get back to shore dragging that. We'd run out of fuel before we uh, even got the boat on the plane. So I'm into Budweiser time now and we're going to relax and I think that's a good time to close out the video. So you've seen a good idea of some of the fantastic shark fishing you can get in a self-drive boat, maybe 160 bucks a day, fishing in the evening, giant tarpon, big lemon sharks, huge hammerhead sharks. Well, if we do get another one, anything else will be really a bonus.